Hi Paul, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. It's good to see you. Looking at comfort in times of sorrow. Uh, sorry, relief in times of suffering. And uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 12, <coughs> verse 8 to 10. For this thing I besought the Lord thrice that it might depart from me. And he said unto me, My grace is sufficient for thee, for my strength is made perfect in weakness. Most gladly, therefore, will I rather glory in my infirmities, that the power of Christ may rest upon me. Therefore I take pleasures in infirmities, in reproaches, in necessities, in persecutions, in distress, for Christ's sake. For when I am weak, then I am strong. Hebrews 12, 3-13 For consider him that endureth such contradictions of sinners against himself, lest you be wearied and faint in your minds. You have not yet resisted unto blood, striving against sin. And you have forgotten the exhortation which speaketh unto you as unto children. My son, despise not thou the chastising of the Lord, nor faint when thou art rebuked of him. For whom the Lord loveth, he chastiseth and scourgeth every son whom he receiveth. If you endure chastising, God dealeth with you as with sons. For what son is he whom the Father chastiseth not? But if you be without chastisement, whereon all are partakers, then are you bastards and not sons. Furthermore, we have had fathers of our flesh which corrected us, and we gave them reverence. Shall we not much rather be subjection unto the Father of spirits and live? For they, for they verily for a few days chastise us after their own pleasure, but he for our profit that we might be partakers of his holiness. Now no chastising for the present seemeth to be joyous, but grievous. Nevertheless afterwards it yieldeth the peaceable fruit of righteousness unto them which are exercised thereby. Wherefore, lift up the hands which hang down, and the feeble knees, and make straight paths for your feet, lest that which is lame be turned out of the way, but let rather be healed. Keep going. God is a God of comfort, and he will comfort you today. Okay. Let me just pray for you. Lord, I just pray for this person who sees this video, that you would really comfort them today. I ask this, Lord, in your name. Amen. Amen. God bless you.